Got one. Got a good one. How's it going, everybody? Blue Cat Kobe here. Uh, like I said in the last video, I'm very, very famous for for forgetting to do my intros, my outros, the videos. Last video I posted, we was out on the boat at Clear Creek, and we was able to go out there and catch quite a few fish. I caught way more fish than what was in the video. I just didn't have a lot of time. To, I didn't want to have a hour long video. We caught a bunch of pounders, and I didn't want to put them in there. But uh. For the most part, the video you're about to be watching today is going to be the very first time last year in 2017 we went to Clear Creek. And uh, prior before going to Clear Creek, about an hour before, I found a guy on Facebook that had an old vintage uh, Daiwa Procaster reel. And I was very interested in it. I love to use old reels. So I called my fiance Whitney up. She went and bought the reel for me. She met us at the lake. And I ended up having a blast using that old Bantam, oh not old Bantam, that old uh, Procaster reel. So in this video, it's gonna kind of be uh, it's gonna kind of be all over the place. We're gonna be throwing crankbaits, gonna be throwing worms, you know, all that kind of good stuff. So if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to, leave something in the comments. And uh, here, I guess let's get to some fishing. Didn't say anything. He said it worked just fine. He was sketchy. I mean, the first time I met him, he was kind of sketchy. Alrighty, I love you. It works. I mean, it's gonna be a worm, Paul. Love you, baby. Thanks for bringing me my future reel. Love you. Got one. Got a good one. Oh, he got me in the brush. Get out of that brush. I can't tell. Yeah. Got him. Yeah, he's over here. Boat flip. There it is right there, using this brush over here. So, first fish of the day, that's not a bad one right there. What I'm throwing is a seven inch power worm, black and gold with the crawdad color. And he just smoked it. Man, look at that catfish. Just got this, Whitney brought me this new reel. First cast with the new reel, caught one. I'll move these out of the way. I don't know if that's luck or skill right there. That brings hope to my day right there. Did he hit it hard? Oh, he smoked it. He went straight. He hit it and went straight to the bottom with it. He wasn't playing around. He didn't want on here. Got one. It's a good one. About the same size as the one I had. Want your warm back? I don't know if it's tore up or not. There you go. These bass fight good here, don't they? Bit of stick. Hook sets are free. Man, you just caught the biggest one of the day right there. He was hungry, wasn't he? That don't count. He wasn't 12 inches. It counts. camera and I caught a little chunk Whew, you can barely see it those are rocks 
I only got like 20 minutes of recording time left, so I turned the camera off, and this fish smoked it whenever I passed the tree. So that's number two for me for the day. We can get him back in the water. Crawl did. Oh, there's one back at you? Yeah. I'm going to go buy some more of them. Put on a crankbait. Coming to the dam. What kind of fish is that? Mm -hmm. See the coloration on it? crazy we uh we come up here to the dam throw some crankbaits i'm throwing a bill norman sexy shad cutter look at the coloration on that bass he come up out of that little brush pile right there and smoked it as i come by with it we're gonna get him up into the water real quick All my fish from me. We're lighting them up today. Well, I think that's just about gonna wrap it up for today's video. Uh, as I said, that was my very first time on a boat fishing at Clear Creek, and uh, it was a blast. I loved it. The water's real clear in some spots, some spots it's real stained, so you had all different kinds of water to fish a lot of flooded flooded timber in there a bunch of flooded timber in there and uh flooded timber just gives a lot of cover and you don't have enough time in one day to flip every little piece of cover in there so you kind of hit and miss where the fish are so but that's gonna do it for today's video thank you guys for watching like i said earlier if you did like the video make sure to leave a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and leave something down in the comments let me know what you think about my videos and uh, i'll catch y'all sometime next week